These are weeds. I'm using this to illustrate the comparison to my marriage before and after fascinating womanhood. This is my marriage now. I would like for you to pass this around and take a little pink flower as a reminder of your femininity. This is to remind me that I'm a feminine woman and not an aggressive female. If you do everything and are very capable, you will soon lose your husband. You know, if a woman is really honest, I think she has to admit that she isn't neutral towards her husband. Either she is cutting him in half like this, or maybe even bashing him. Maybe he's kind of bound in chains like this. Or she can look to him, give him the staff of leadership, and let him know that she wants him to take this responsibility. Uh, we feel that if a woman treats a man like a king, that he will in turn treat her like a queen. A part of what we teach in character in Fascinating Womanhood is chastity. That is that a woman who is an ideal woman is morally pure. She does not uh, go along with the new morality. That is, she believes that sex is reserved for marriage and marriage only. Ladies, we've been sold on the idea that a man goes to other women for sex. Well, I've got news for you. Many couples that are very sexually compatible, the husband leaves the wife. And to a woman, many times, who's not even as beautiful, as efficient. Why? Because she understands him. She understands. She listens to him. And that's more important, believe it or not, than the sex. Uh, Sue Rafik is with us today, and uh, she's from a lib family. She's no longer uh, a lib-minded uh, woman. And uh, she had a personal experience in regard to listening to her husband. Uh, this is before Fascinating Womanhood, and this is like about 6 o'clock at night, and the phone's rang. Okay. Hello. Yeah. You're going out again tonight? She's just your secretary. You don't have to go out with her all the time. I'm here, you know. Well, if you're going to go out and get drunk, well, you know what's happened with that, too. Okay, well, listen, why don't you just drop dead? Goodbye. <laughs> That's no kidding. That's the way it was. Okay. Now I'd like to share what it was like.